Alright, what's up you fucking bitches? Please subscribe to this fucking channel. My main channel got a strike and I can't upload for a fucking week. We're talking about Jenny69. If you don't know who she is, she's like an Instagram model with an OnlyFans and I guess she raps too. If she keeps up the good work, then she could possibly become Donald Trump's fourth wife. She's also one of the few girls who looks better with glasses. Not that she looks bad without them, but the glasses were like an improvement. And not every guy is going to agree with me, and that's fine. Alright, so Jenny69 was at a video shoot, and she was bumping SPM, South Park Mexican. And for those who don't know, SPM has been in jail for the past 20 years because he impregnated a 13-year-old and allegedly diddled a 9-year-old. The food community is really split on SPM. SPM. Some people think he got set up, other people hate him because they think he's a diddler, but we're not talking about him. Just know that some people hate him and other people love him. Anyway, Jenny69 got jumped by Lady Pinks just for listening to SPM, and maybe Pinks wanted some clout, get people talking about her. Lady Pinks has 160,000 followers on Instagram compared to Jenny69's 1 million, so she was jealous, trying to get attention. This is Pink's claim to fame. I didn't know about her before this, and I won't know about her after this. The dudes who jumped the other 6 9 are completely irrelevant now. They wanted to be famous, but they're about to go back to painting houses. Pinky is going to go back to selling her coochie to gym teachers and Texas Senator Ted Cruz for $86 an hour. Low key, I'm not sure what the fuck Pinky does. If she's a rapper, stripper, she probably does an OnlyFans if there's a link tree in her bio. And I ain't really trying to see this chick naked, but if that's the shit you pound off to, then be my guest. Some people like fucking dudes. But as long as Ted Cruz enjoys getting pissed on, Pinky is going to be able to make her $300 car payments. She's mad that Jenny69 is listening to an alleged child molester, so she jumped her. By that logic, she's got around 2 million Spotify listeners to beat up next. It's not just SPM, she's got to beat up everyone who listens to Michael Jackson. Just go to his memorial with a baseball bat. Roman Polanski still makes movies after drugging little girls and diddling them. At least SPM got his freedom taken away. This guy was never held accountable. Now Pinky was friends with Carolyn Rodriguez. Carolyn was actually married to SPM while he was in prison and I guess she talks shit about him now. I believe SPM tried to call her and she gave the phone to this dude on high power and he cussed out SPM. You're a convicted child molester, bro. No problem with you. I got a pro yeah, I got a, I got a, I got a problem with child molesters, bro. I got a problem with child molesters, and you a convicted child molesters. And we don't play that. Now, Flyboy from the food community actually jumped in when he saw Jenny69 getting attacked. He kind of broke it up, and while doing that, he got beat up a little bit too. And I seen what happened, and I jumped on top of Jenny. I peeled one of the hyenas off, and I fucking the other hyena was too strong. I couldn't her off so i covered jenny's body and i took two homes and i just got jumped two weeks ago so i felt bad for her and don't get me wrong a group of girls can fuck up a man if they know how to fight shit a group of 12 year olds can fuck up a grown man the same way three wolves can fuck up one bear in terms of weight we got 300 pounds of hyena and 150 pounds of homie now the music video shooting they were at was for Down aka Kilo, shout out to him, lean like a cholo, that was my shit back in the 4th grade, and some people think he set up Jenny69, he denies it, but Jenny thinks he was behind it though. Bad compared to what happens next, this is when it gets crazy, so then he calls me to the back of the building you guys, and he doesn't let my assistant go back there with me, and this is where nobody's at, and then he tells me, the reason why you got jumped is because you... Uh, listen to SPM and you support him. He was like, you know, he's a child. And I was just like, to be honest, I was like, I don't really know about that. I just, I just posted a video of me listening to his song or whatever. And he's like, so, you know, that's why they jumped you is because you listen to SPM. Then he goes, well, he's like, you can't call the cops. He's like, you can't call the cops and you can't report. He said, because it's going to ruin your reputation. He's like, you don't want to end up like 6 9 And I was just like, uh, Kilo, I don't care about that. I was like, I'm not from the streets. I'm not a chola. I don't. I was like, I was attacked on set while I'm working. I'm like, I am going to call the cops and I am going to press charges. Senior changed, you guys. Like, he went from being cool to now 
he went into like you, you like the same way that pinks was looking at me before she got me the same look he had in his eyes and then he was like so do you what spf he's like do you with him with his music and then i was just kind of like well i like his music yeah he was like well then you can't be on the song he's like and i don't want you on the video and i was just like okay and i was like okay that's fine i don't need to be here i was like i'm just gonna pack my stuff and i'm just gonna go i started to get super scared because i was in the back of the building so then i just start speed walking and he's like right behind me and i'm walking through trying to get like I'm starting to get like flashbacks of what happened because <laughs> it was so scary like hold on <sighs> like I'm still having flashbacks like I still haven't processed everything and so I'm walking down the hall and I'm just like borderline running because I'm terrified of this man and as I'm walking he's like off my set like right on my neck you guys like in the back of like right behind me he's like off my sick like i don't even remember what he was saying and at that moment i just started crying and i was trying to fight my assistant because i was just like oh my god like i already like i just got jumped and now i'm being attacked by the person that invited me to the video it was like if you weren't a girl he's like I'll you. I'll and i just got so scared i was like where's exit i was like where's the exit like i need to get out of here before i get attacked on again and then the reason why i started panicking dude i started crying immediately because i was like i was set up like i know for a fact that he had something to do with them running up on me on set of his music video this is like when tupac thought biggie set him up in new york it's not even the great value version it's the me pueblo supermarket version of tupac and biggie I'm not even gonna entertain this rumor too much because it's unconfirmed. I didn't even know this fucking guy was still dropping music. That one hit from 20 years set him up for life, so shout out to Kilo. Anyway, what do y'all think about this? I'm out.